Hey, 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 y'all. Welcome to the channel. For those of you that are new, welcome to Birth and Bosses with Felicia. I am Boss Lady Fee, guys. Listen, I know it's a little bit late tonight, but I did want to give you guys a quick few minutes of a video. And when I say quick, I do mean quick. It's going to be real quick, guys. I did not want to go another day because I did not do a video on Sunday. And I know that you guys are used to seeing me doing videos every day. I think I should get a shout out for doing videos every day guys it's hard work it is a lot of hard work trying to get videos up every day which are every day um you know just your everyday livelihood it's hard to get a um video in each day i did take a break yesterday and i honestly was going to take a complete break today but i did want to just do this to let you guys know that i'm fine i'm well nothing's wrong with me um, I just needed a quick break, okay? That's all, nothing more, nothing less. Um, but tonight, I wanna show y'all this basket I'm working on. I'm not going to wrap it up tonight, but I actually did pretty much prepare the basket um, for you guys, and we were going to wrap it up on the channel. But, well, I'm gonna wrap it up off camera and show you guys what it looked like on tomorrow. Um, it's just a simple box. For those of you that have been following me for a while, You've seen these boxes that my mom wrap up for my business during some of the busy holidays. And this is just one of the ones that I had left over from the beginning of the year. Um, and I have a handbag as, as well to go in the box um, that came out of my boutique, okay? So I have a handbag, I have some makeup um, that I got from Dollar General right after, I wanna say it was after Christmas. Um, I also got this um, pineapple um, plant from, where was it, Walgreens. And I got this bath set from Dollar General. And this bath cloth I got from Dollar General, okay? And I just put it in one of the boxes, like I said, that my mom um, makes for me during the holidays. And I just stuffed it with newspaper like I always do for all of my um, gift baskets or whatever it is that I'm designing. I always start off with newspaper and that's all i've done right here with this guys and i have already made the bow um you will notice on a couple of my latest videos i've been using this yellow and black polka dot ribbon this is some ribbon that i've had sitting around for a while so i'm just going ahead and using it and i also incorporated it with some mesh okay i incorporated it with some mesh so when we put it up um on the basket you guys will see how cute it's going to turn out. But this actual basket, believe it or not, I'm gonna be selling it for Christmas. Um, if you're new following me, then you may not know and you may say Christmas. Yes, we are going to be selling this for Christmas. Items does not have to look like Christmas. It does not have to have Christmas sayings on it in order to sell it for Christmas. But this particular basket will um, go in um to the inventory pile for christmas okay guys so i'm looking so forward to doing a video with you all live while i'm out vending on the street corners for christmas if you are not on the street guys the streets is where it is i you know i love those of you that sell on social media i sell on social media myself but do not sit on social media and god heaven knows do not sit around waiting for friends and family to support. If you want to get into the big money like I do for our, um, holidays, major holidays, then you definitely want to get out on the streets, okay? The streets is going to make you thousands of more dollars than it would with you just selling to random people that you know or even people that you are familiar with. You will make so, so much money, more money on the streets. So make sure that you're getting your inventory stockpile ready for the holidays guys we're gonna bundle up we're gonna get some socks some thick socks we're gonna get some mittens we're gonna get some hats some hoodies some gloves and we're gonna get out here on these streets and make our money guys and get prepared for one of the greatest one of the greatest holidays actually the greatest holiday for my business um which is valentine's day now christmas i normally do pretty well but i have never did um, hundreds of baskets like I do for Valentine's Day. So, um, yeah, I'm going to stretch myself this year. So we'll see how things turn out this year. Um, also, guys, I wanted to show you, um, and my table is full of receipts, y'all. Y'all know I've been, um, 
I've been um, organizing stuff for the last couple of days. So I have my receipts out. But I wanted to show you guys this. I don't know if you remember us making this sympathy basket on the channel. Guys, I sold this basket um, a couple days ago on eBay. And I'm going to probably do a video with you all tomorrow. Um, this actually hasn't been um, packaged for shipping as of yet. I just sim simply stuck it inside the box to make sure that this box was going to be a good fit. This is why I tell y'all all the time that I collect boxes of all sizes. This was actually an Amazon package box. And um, I just keep these boxes... Um, took the way until I sell items or I get ready to wrap them up like the box that you just seen with the handbag in it. It's just simply a regular box. If you're interested in seeing my mom wrap those, there is an old video from last year with my mom wrapping those boxes. If you are new to my channel, have not watched that video, I will do another video. Just let me know in the comments below if you are um, if you're wanting to see my mom wrap up some of the boxes, but yeah, so I did sell this guys. You all have been asking me about how I package and ship off things. I'm also going to be showing you how I list things. So maybe that'll be, um, one of the videos for tomorrow, but this is a perfect fit box. All I got to do is go in and put my newspaper in between and on top so that there is actually no damage while it's being shipped okay and this actual gift basket i think i had it listed for 39 dollars, and i had it where you could i could accept offers okay i did accept a 30 dollar offer on this gift because guys guess what i paid for this um box all these items that you see came from dollar tree so there's one two three four five items and something has gotten on my plastic i don't know what that is I'll get that off before I ship it. But anyway, there are, um, how many I say? Two, four, five items from Dollar Tree. So that is five, six, twenty-five. Um, and I probably spent about 50 cents. So about $7 on this basket. I made a $23 profit, which is much less profit than I normally make. But hey, y'all, it is what it is. It's, it's a win-win all the way across the board. $23 profit. I can live with it, you know? just to be selling a random basket. And I have had customers off of eBay that becomes longtime customers. So yeah, I was willing to take um, a $9 pay cut just because of the fact that I only spent $7 on the basket anyway, okay? I'm gonna include a business card in here. I'm gonna package it really nice and ship it off. And hey, let the chips fall where they may, guys. Hopefully, I will snag a new customer from this actual deal so make sure you're not only selling on social media but that you're also selling on ebay um and all the other different um platforms that you're able to sell on okay guys listen i'm gonna get off this video i told you it would be quick and it's actually longer than i thought it would be but make sure guys that you like share comment and subscribe um hit the bell so that each and every time i upload a video you will be the first to be notified get your money honey and fill your bag and make sure you shop my website feliciawinstead.com all right guys love you so much i'll see you tomorrow bye